morning, everybody. It is Saturday, and that means it is time to imagine it. It is an excellent weekend here at the Science Center. It so what is. are we doing? Well, we're going to do some egg science, and we have actually um, an egg event happening this weekend as well, egg okay. drop challenge. All right. But I thought we'd talk about eggs here. Let me give you this egg, all right? Okay. The eggs are kind of cool in that they're sort of, they're, they're incredibly strong. They're sort of shaped like an arch on the top and the bottom. Yeah. So if you take that egg and put it in the palm of your hand. Okay. And then wrap your hand. Oh, you've got a ring in that hand. Ah. Mm. Uh, yeah, maybe take that off. That could cause like this. a pressure point that could build up enough pressure to crack the egg oh, for what okay. we're going to do. All right. Forgot about that. So Kay. put that in there. Okay. But then palm your hand. And mm -hmm. what we're going to do is just gonna wrap your hand around it, squeeze. There's always a danger it could explode. Yeah. But it's. I okay. Mean, yeah. No, I'm squeezing. I can. I can tell you're squeezing. Okay. Okay, so that's all because of that arch, okay? okay? It distributes the weight along that. And now if we were to squeeze it this way, uh -huh. don't do it. Okay. Um, that could be very messy. All right. right. So what I thought we'd try to do is, you know, we, we do this from time to time to see how many eggs it takes to support a 35 pound cinder block. Oh my, okay. okay? So okay. The, the, what about this guy? Do you okay, want this I'll, I'll take okay. that back. So the question is, how low do you think we can go? I'm pretty confident with eight eggs, I can lift the cinder block up and set it on there and it'll be fine. For how long? Well, for, uh, forever. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna take my hands away. Okay. But for you, yeah, that's, how low can we go? Uh, what do you think? Can, can we do, can we do, can we do this? Yeah, that. Okay, this is like, I feel like I'm playing Jenga. Um, I feel like you could do that, but only if you do that as well. Okay, so we take that one off. So you, like the, you like the symmetry. I do. And mm -hmm. that's an excellent point. What we're talking about here is the difference between force and pressure, right? So force is just a push or a pull. If I push you or pull on you, sure. you move. But um, if we put the cinder block on top of these eggs, its force is distributed over these six eggs now. Sure. So each egg is only supporting one sixth of the weight of this cinder block, about okay. 35 pounds or so. Okay. You think we can go any lower? Um, yes. I think that we could eliminate <laughs> these two. Oh, <laughs> you're going right for the end game. Okay, so <laughs> just four eggs. Yeah, I don't know. Should I mean, sometimes I'm good at Jenga. I'm not really sure. Do you think they're good where they are? I mean, I, I think it's okay. I would, I feel like maybe we should put one back in the center, oh, okay. perhaps. All right, we'll try that. Okay. Okay, so now here's the, here's the tricky part. Okay. Um, hopefully I can lift this up, and you're wearing the lab coat because if this fails, mm -hmm. this is one of those things where it fails catastrophically okay, and you awesome. get just like a, a spray good. of egg. All right, well, here we go. Let's okay. see. Mm -hmm. Is it going to work? It's heavy. Come on, Carl. You work out. Oh. Oh. Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh, I hear oh. some cracking. Yeah, don't, don't. Yep, this guy, this guy's breaking back oh, here. Oh, okay. We're going to walk away. Yeah, all right. Let's just walk away. Come, come on over here. I don't have shoes on, so I <laughs> mean, okay. I could lose all my toes. That's, I didn't sign up for this. That's because okay. I've got a walkway of eggs for you. Okay. So go ahead and stand over here. Okay. We're going to apply the same principle. Oh, boy. Your 120 pounds is going to be distributed. Oh, you're so kind. Okay. <laughs> over these individual eggs. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. So what I want you to do is you're going to start with your left foot. Okay. Start with that one. And if you can end up with your heel maybe right in the middle, line your foot up with the middle. I'll hold your hand. Okay, here. like this? Like you're saying like this? Yep. And okay. we're, we're going to do them all. Oh, we're not boy. stopping. Wow, these just, are cold. Okay. Just gently. Okay. Gently. Uh, okay. Okay. Got it. Next one. Got it. Oh, dude, I feel like I could just do this really quickly. Don't get, I'm getting don't, confident. don't get overconfident. I'm feeling confident. <laughs> You're doing really well. My, uh, my four-year-old did this, but he only weighs 30 pounds. Oops. Oh no, I didn't have that, my foot all the way back. That, I felt one crack. That's okay, that's okay. You're doing fine. Look at that. Look at that. You're walking mm. on eggs without breaking them. Sweet. Oh, I did <laughs> no, one, aggressively move one out of the box. One, one stuck, stuck to your to my foot. foot. Okay. Mm -hmm. You pulled it right out. So, wow. Okay, I crushed one there, but that's pretty that's, good. That's not bad for the number that we had. Excellent. Mm. And, and back here, even... I think you meant excellent. <laughs> it is excellent. Now, even though we broke one back to one crack, yeah. it's still holding up. Okay, um, so that brings me back to my earlier question. Well, one, that's a variable. And two, how long before that... <sighs> You'll have to come down and check out Egg Stream okay, Science. Okay, well, I will not be standing back there. <laughs> and see what happens. So. All right, well, if you want to take part in the Egg drop, ch drop Challenge, it is happening this weekend here at the Imagination Station, and that sounds like a lot of fun for families. It is. Awesome. That's included with your regular admission, and that is how you imagine it.